What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and look at this background. That's right, it's been a hot minute, but we are opening up some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Uh, it's been, no, it hasn't been that long, but we finally got our hands on these new tins. It's a little bit smaller, it's a little bit longer, but uh, it looks really nice. This is the gold sarcophagus. And we finally got our hands on it, and I feel like the, so far the reception of this box has been very positive. You know, there's there's no like, oh, this is like a hundred dollar card or something crazy like that. But you know, there's it's pretty like spaced out wide. A lot of good reprints um, that arguably the TCG needed. A couple that I'm not crazy about, like Sky Striker, Mobilizing Gauge. Like you just came out in Battles of Legend to reprint, and then you reprint again, like. Literally a couple months after. Um, another one is the Boral Sword Dragon that recently came, or Savage Boral Sword. Uh, but one thing I want to check real quick is how useful is this tin? And can we use it for storing cards? We have two different kinds of sleeved cards. We have the Pokemon Magic the Gathering size and then some Yu-Gi-Oh ones. So let's just take a look. Ooh, that is not bad. I think this one will be a little bit snug, but hey, that's kind of a good thing. So yeah, actually look at that. So if you kind of have enough cards to basically fill this, it shouldn't move around too much, just a little bit, but that's not too bad. And the height is pretty perfect. So, all right, pretty, uh, I can get behind this tin, has some cool texture. So yeah, so far this product seems really nice. Another thing I really like is that the promos you get, it's almost like a little promo pack. You know, it's not like, Oh, here's, oh, you opened a bunch of tins. Here's the same promos for the hundredth time. You get, I don't know how many cards, but there is, it's kind of random. So I am a big fan of that. As per usual, they come with three of these mega packs. And this is the 2019 gold, gold, gold sarcophagus. Let's get into this. And one of the biggest cards, the Nibiru, it's, I believe it's like a hand trap is in these so you know i feel like they're constantly improving i guess i think one of the complaints from the kaiba tins was like oh cool i get these same promos every single uh every single box yet you still put them in the set and that wasn't well received the 2018 mega tins like cool promos for like the Jaden and the um i can't remember the other guy's name uh but they're the same every time so here we have something a little bit different which I do like and okay this is a very cool let's see if we can make it this is like that prismatic secret rare magician of black chaos max that card looks amazing neo kaiser glider I'm gonna be just shifting the cards a lot just to appreciate that very cool rare uh rare oh yes I'm all right so like the the gods I want definitely want a full set of gods you know they're not super worthwhile this is like the I don't know 50th printing them you can't really see much foiling but I just love the god cars so can we get another we got regeki very nice ah so I did a video about like some of my OG vintage cards however uh, something made a mistake on it so I wasn't I did I do plan on refilming it but it does involve this card right here bit of a spoiler alert. and then ooh, dark ruler no more this is one of the better ones See if we can see negate the effects of all face-up monsters on your opponent currently controls until the end of turn. That is very solid, right? There. Actually, we're gonna sleeve up a couple of these guys. For my box of sleeves, we're going to the white sleeves. So putting this guy in there, very nice hit right there. And obelisk, we can toss Regek in there too. There are some cards that just don't get old. I feel like Regeki, Mirror Force. You know, are they used? Sometimes, not always, but. Just a card that always will have appreciation. Blue Eyes, Dark Magician. That's the thing with Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, oh, what cards? There are cards that can just survive. <laughs> like, 50 printings. Alright, so very cool cards. Those are just the promos. Let's get into these Mega Packs. Mega is appropriate word. 16 cards? That's like... It's MTG levels right there. Oh man, look at that. Compared to sometimes some sets, you only get five. All right, let's see. Mythical Institution, Crystal Master. This card looks familiar. 
Performer Pal Goldfang, Waking the Dragon. I believe that card's actually pretty good too. Vendred Nightmare, Vorticular Dragon. All right, so I believe it's uh, Super Secret, Ultra, then Rare. All right, let's see. Vampire Familiar, Goki Moonsault, mm, something. Background Dragon. Oh, a lot of these cards are very familiar. All right. Okay, so our super is DDD, Flame King Genghis, Noble Knight, ooh, Nightmare Corruptor Ibli, very nice, I feel like I'm having trouble with the focus, then Solomon Great Foxy, I don't remember, were, were you a Savage Strike card? I don't remember, but I'm pretty sure we pulled a lot of you, and it looks like you got a rarity bump. We yeah, a lot of very good cards that, you know, a lot of value that's distributed a bunch of different cards, which I really like compared to it just being like a lottery. It's this card or bust. All right, let's see. Salmon Great Jack Jaguar. Oh, this thing again. Goki Bear Hug. Boral Regenerator. And then here's the Draco. Let's see. Secret Ultra Rare. Let's go with that. All right, Gatekeeper, Supernaturalist, Crusadia Vanguard, Vampire Awakening, some vampire stuff, World Legacy Struggle, Clock Spark Toy, don't remember you, Sky Striker, ooh, Sky Striker cards again, uh, Crusadia Draco is our super, Rare is just Center Frog, he's picking his, is he picking his nose? Herald of the Abyss, not familiar with you, the Ultra, and then Sekka's Lights, hmm. Watch like uh, someone like open open these things. For, I think open a whole case. Open for like 30 minutes. I feel like he was getting better pulls. <laughs> Cosmo Brain. All right, last pack already. That's the only thing with these Megatons. Is they go super fast. Token collector. This was a promo at some point. Transfamiliar. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Alter guys. Multi Faker. Very nice pull right there. And what did we throw on the ground, or almost on the ground? Thunder Dragon Fusion. Ooh, Thunder Dragon support as well. Wouldn't mind a Colossus. Altergeist Multifaker. Very cool. I think this thing, did this get hit by the ban list? Danger Bigfoot. Very nice. I think we pulled uh, one of these in something not too long ago. Danger Bigfoot. Very good. I believe this is a down downgrade though. And then Space Insulator. I remember you. Vampire Red Baron. Revendred Evolution, Sky Striker Mecha Eagle Booster. All right, and then Sign Up Fusion. Oh, so many cards. I'm not used to opening so many Yu-Gi-Oh cards in a single pack. All right, let's throw a couple more sleeves on these two guys. So, a very solid start to our tins. And we're going to be doing a couple of these, uh, so if you do want to see more of these, uh, definitely show some love, hit that like button, and that'll kind of be my indication to, you guys want to see more, let's open some more. Alright, we got Danger Bigfoot, Multifaker, Regeki, classic card right there, ah, Obelisk, we definitely want uh, your friends Slifer and Ra, for sure. Dark Ruler No More, very solid hit right there. So. That's it for this opening, pretty quick, only three packs, but uh, yeah, definitely guys, thanks for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe all down below. Thanks for all the support on the channel recently, it's been very nice. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.